I'm gonna say a TV show, and if you've watched it, put a finger down. Gossip Girl, The Vampire Diaries, Grey's Anatomy, The Fosters, Riverdale, On My Block, All American, Outer Banks, Jane the Virgin, Alexa and Katie, Glee, Friends, Stranger Things, Pretty Little Liars, The Office, Gilmore Girls, Private Practice, Shameless, One Tree Hill, The Good Doctor, Good Trouble, Bella and the Bulldogs, Fuller House, Greenhouse Academy, Flash, Supergirl, Arrow, New Girl, The Originals, Victorious, Criminal Minds, Supernatural, 13 Reasons Why, You, The 100, Elliot, Lucifer, Never Have I Ever, Love is Blind, Mako Mermaids, High School Musical The Series, Put a finger down, bitch girl edition. Put a finger down if you've ever told someone that you're going to go to sleep, but you really don't because you don't want to talk to them. Put a finger down if your friend asks to spend the night and you say, no, my mom said no, but really, your mom said yes. Put a finger down if you give everyone the bitch face just because it's not your day. Put a finger down if you've ever called a teacher a bitch. Put a finger down if you're going down the hallway in class and all the guys go, oops, psych. Put a finger down if you ever hit someone in the face for taking some of your food. Put a finger down if people think you have a rusty bitch face all the time and think you're angry. Put a finger down if you ever hit your parents. Put a finger down if there's someone that you hate but they did absolutely nothing to you. Put a finger down if you hated school because of the teachers. And last, put a finger down if you've ever been called a bitch. Put a finger down, sibling edition. Put a finger down if you have a brother. Put a finger down if you have a sister. Put a finger down if you have more than two siblings. Put a finger down if you share a room with your sibling. Put a finger down if you have an older sibling. Put a finger down if you have a younger sibling. Put a finger down if you're a twin or if you have twin siblings. Put a finger down if you fight a lot with your sibling. Put a finger down if you only have one sibling. Put a finger down if your sibling annoys you a lot. Put a finger down if you have a step sibling. Put a finger down if you have a half sibling. Put a finger down if you have more than four siblings. Put a finger down if you are the oldest sibling. And put a finger down if you are the youngest sibling. Put a finger down, teenager edition. Now, no cheating. We want to see your real, authentic reaction. So pause this video, click do it, and let's get started. Put a finger down if you have or had a job while in school. Put a finger down if you've ever owned a pair of Converse or Vans. Put a finger down if you've ever had Life360 on your phone. Put a finger down if you've ever skipped school. Put a finger down if you've ever been to a party. Put a finger down if you've ever been in a relationship. Put a finger down if you've ever thrifted. Put a finger down if you've ever had a curfew. Put a finger down if a girl or a guy has ever asked for your Snapchat. Put a finger down if you've ever dyed your hair. Put a finger down if you've ever cracked your phone. Put a finger down if you've ever owned an iPhone. Put a finger down if you've ever snuck out. Put a finger down if you've ever cut your own hair. Put a finger down things apparently only weird people do, part 6. Put a finger down if you try to breathe quieter when walking up the stairs so it doesn't sound like you're fighting for your life. Put a finger down if you feel safe under the blanket as if it's going to protect you from anything. Put a finger down if you restart a song in the middle of it because you didn't pay enough attention to it. Put a finger down if you put your music on shuffle but you still skip until you find the song you like. Put a finger down if you get anxiety from trying to put your change back so you don't hold up the line. Put a finger down if you pretend to be on your phone so you don't look lonely. Put a finger down if you pretend to look at other items because someone else is in the aisle looking at the item you actually want. 10 things that all women are guilty of. If you want to have some fun with this, you can use it as a 10 finger challenge. Let's go! Put your freezing cold feet on your partner's legs when you get in bed. Doing weird arm stretches to check your BO in public. Taking your bra off immediately upon returning home. Losing bobby pins and hair ties everywhere around your house and in your car. After a shower or bath, sitting on your bed in your towel for way too long. Seeing an insane price tag on an item and pretend that you're still considering it anyway. Proclaim that you have nothing to wear while staring at a closet full of clothes. Spending five minutes of every shower picking hair out of your butt. Stealing your partner's sweaters with no intention of returning them unless you need a refill of their smell. Anytime someone compliments you when you're wearing a dress that has pockets, you say, Thanks! It has pockets! Finger down, dumb edition. If you put five more fingers down, you're the dumb friend. Finger down if you've choked on water before. Put a finger down if you've dropped your phone on your face. Put a finger down if you went back to sleep because you wanted to finish the storyline of your dream. 
finger down if you've tripped up the stairs. Finger down if you've tripped down the stairs. Finger down if you're an Aquarius, Leo, Libra, or Taurus. Finger down if you've started to like someone because of a dream you had. Finger down if you text with typos and bad grammar. Finger down if you have to recite the whole alphabet to find out which letter goes where. Finger down if you've sent a text to the wrong person. Put a finger down, girly edition. Now, no cheating. We want to see your real, authentic reaction, so pause this video, click to it, and let's get started. Put a finger down if you have more than three steps in your skincare routine. Put a finger down if you're wearing earrings right now. Put a finger down if you do a full face of makeup for school. Put a finger down if you own more than two pairs of fake lashes. Put a finger down if your nails are done right now. Put a finger down if you own more than five necklaces. Put a finger down if you own a body mist from Victoria's Secret Pink or Rue 21. Put a finger down if you own a tennis skirt. Put a finger down if you've ever written your name and then drew a heart next to it. Put a finger down if you've ever gotten a spray tan or self-tanned. Put a finger down if you have a bracelet on right now. Put a finger down, nice edition. Now, no cheating, we want to see your real, authentic reaction, so pause this video, click do it, and let's get started. Put a finger down if you smile at strangers. Put a finger down if you've ever helped someone with homework. Put a finger down if you've ever held the door open for somebody. Put a finger down if you've ever laughed at a joke that wasn't funny. Put a finger down if you've ever helped somebody move. Put a finger down if you've ever said sorry about something that wasn't your fault. Put a finger down if you've ever donated to a charity before. Put a finger down if you've ever pretended to like somebody's music. Put a finger down if you've ever carried somebody's groceries for them. Put a finger down, random edition. Put a finger down if you are currently wearing red. Put a finger down if you have a pet. Put a finger down if you were born in the month of June. Put a finger down if you have your own room. Put a finger down if you have two or more siblings. Put a finger down if you have a job. Put a finger down if you are currently in a relationship. Put a finger down if you can drive. Put a finger down if you follow Charlie D'Amelio on TikTok. Put a finger down if you shop at Target. Put a finger down if you watch Netflix. Put a finger down if you hate coffee. Put a finger down if you play a sport. Put a finger down if you are older than 16. Put a finger down if your best friend has the same initial as you. Put a finger down, you are super innocent addition. Put a finger down if you don't smoke. Put a finger down if you've never vaped before. Put a finger down if you've never tried alcohol. Put a finger down if you've never had a boyfriend or a girlfriend. Put a finger down if you've never gotten expelled. Put a finger down if you've never gotten suspended. Put a finger down if you've never gotten into detention. Put a finger down if you've never run from the police. Put a finger down if your friends do bad things but you choose not to. Put a finger down if you don't get nervous when the drug dogs come to school. And lastly, put a finger down if you don't cuss or swear. Ladies, this one is for you. Put a finger down and if you have more than five fingers down by the end of this, you might actually be the fuck boy. Put a finger down if you're always Snapchatting three or more people at any given time just because you're bored. <laughs> Put a finger down if you've ever talked to someone that you weren't interested in at all just to distract yourself from the person that you're actually interested in. Put a finger down if you ghost people the second that you kind of sense things getting a little bit more serious. Put a finger down if you've ever talked to three or more people in the same friend group. Put a finger down if you've ever tried to pull someone just to see if you could. <laughs> Put a finger down if you often get obsessed with people just because they aren't giving you attention and then the second that they do give you attention, you lose interest. Put a finger down if you agree to plans that you have no intention of ever actually following through on and then cancel at the last minute. Put a finger down if you've ever been talking to your friends about a guy and they had to ask you, wait, which guy are we talking about? Put a finger down if you've never done any of these. Put a finger down if you've never gotten stitches. Put a finger down if you've never been to Niagara Falls. Put a finger down if you've never contracted chicken pox. Put a finger down if you've never gotten a tattoo. Put a finger down if you've never gotten a piercing. Put a finger down if you've never flown on a plane. Put a finger down if you've never been on a boat, and this includes lakes, oceans, and rivers. Put a finger down if you've never shot in a gun, and this does not include BBs. Get real, people. Put a finger down if you've never birthed a child. Put a finger down if you've never failed the test. Put a finger down if you've never graduated high school or college. Put a finger down if you've never broken a bone. Put a finger down if you've never slept in a tent before, or have went camping. Put a finger down if you've never seen the Grand Canyon. Put a finger down if you've never went skiing or snowboarding or anything like that. Put a finger down if you've never punched someone. Put a finger down if you've never been divorced. Put a finger down if you've never swam in the ocean. Put a finger down if you've never driven a car.
Put a finger down if you've never been stung by a bee. Put a finger down if you've never changed a dirty diaper. And finally, put a finger down if you have never been to another country. Put a finger down, random addition. Put a finger down if you've ever left the country. Put a finger down if you have more than three siblings. Put a finger down if your birthday is in October, November, August, or September. Put a finger down if your best friend's name starts with an L. Put a finger down if you have a job. Put a finger down if you've left the country more than three times. Put a finger down if your favorite season is summer. Put a finger down if you don't wear makeup. Put a finger down if you are currently wearing red, orange, green, or black. Blind react for alt girls. Most accurate call out. Put a finger down. I guarantee I can get at least eight. Put a finger down if the majority of your money goes to Squishmallows. Put a finger down if your hair has been two or more colors since the beginning of this year. Put a finger down if your socks are the most colorful part of your current outfit. Bonus finger if they're mismatched. Put a finger down if a man has made a creepy advance to you within the past week. Put a finger down if your Spotify playlist would make any normal person recommend that you call a therapist. Put a finger down if you like to be choked but would also cry if someone yelled at you. Put a finger down if you are addicted to the green, caffeine, or nicotine. Put a finger down if you have more than three diagnosed mental disorders. And put a finger down if you have an intense desire for human connection, but also hate the idea of being around people. If I got at least eight, I think that deserves a follow, right? Put a finger down, exposed edition. Now, no cheating. We want to see your real reaction. So pause this video, click do it, and let's get started. Put a finger down if you've ever been on someone's phone without them knowing. Put a finger down if you've ever checked someone's snap score or their location to see if they were ignoring you. Put a finger down if you've ever flirted with more than five people at a time. Put a finger down if you've ever accidentally led someone on. Put a finger down if you've ever friend zoned someone. Put a finger down if you've ever kissed more than two people in one night. Put a finger down if you're currently single. Put a finger down if you've ever told someone I love you and didn't mean it. Put a finger down if you've never been in a relationship. Are you attractive? This is put a finger down, and the more fingers you have down, the more attractive you are. Blind react to this, do at me, and let's go. Put a finger down if you are who you are before what other people say you are. Yeah, put that finger down. Second, put a finger down if you understand that you don't have to be everything. You don't have to be like funny, perfect, beautiful, submissive, agreeable, funny, like... You can be just one of these or none, and you are still a 10 out of 10. Yeah, put that finger down. Good. Next one. Put a finger down if you don't take yourself too, too seriously. Like, I understand if, if you have like a mission, a serious mission, that's okay. But taking yourself seriously around other people all the time, you know what I'm saying? Put a finger down Disney edition. Put a finger down if you've watched more than five Disney movies. Put a finger down if you've watched more than 10 Disney movies. Put a finger down if you have been to Disney World. Put a finger down if you've been a Disney character for Halloween. Put a finger down if you've been to Disneyland. Put a finger down if you've been to the International Disneys. Put a finger down if you have the Disney Signature Book. Put a finger down if you've never been to any of the Disney parks. Put a finger down if you prefer the newer Disney movies. Put a finger down if you prefer the older Disney movies. And put a finger down if you have shopped at the Disney store. No girl has all five. Prove me wrong. One, more than $50 in their bank account. Two, a significant other that they've been in a stable relationship with. Three, the ability to parallel park. Four, a stable relationship with both of their parents. And five, a regular poop schedule. If you have all five, then you're probably elite and I am scared of you. Put a finger down, sibling edition. If you put more than eight fingers down, well, you know what that means. Hit the plus sign for more. Put a finger down, you have a brother. Put a finger down, you have a sister. Put a finger down, you're the youngest. Put a finger down, you're the middle child. Put a finger down, you're the oldest. Put a finger down, you have more than one sibling. Put a finger down if people say that you and your sibling look alike. Put a finger down, you have a twin. Put a finger down if you have twin siblings. Put a finger down, you ever got in a fight with your sibling. Put a finger down, you ever stole their food. Put a finger down, you steal their clothes without them knowing. Put a finger down, you share a room with them. 
Put a finger down and you go into the room just to annoy them. Put a finger down and you get your sibling in trouble. Hit the plus sign for more. Put a finger down, introvert edition. The last one is a little bit controversial. So put a finger down if you've ever hit in public when you saw somebody you knew. Put a finger down if right after you text somebody, they call you and you don't answer the phone. Put a finger down if someone has ever showed up unexpectedly at your house and you didn't answer the door. Put a finger down if you knew the answer in class, but you never raised your hand. Put a finger down if you ever fake text somebody in public to avoid having a conversation. Put a finger down if you have ever left the social gathering extremely early. Put a finger down if you have ever Googled a number instead of answering the phone. Put a finger down if you ever chose to watch Netflix over hanging out with friends. Put a finger down if you needed help in class, but you never asked the teacher for help. Put a finger down if you were low-key glad that we had quarantine. If you put more than five fingers down, you may be introverted. I'm an introvert as well, so let's be introverted together. Put a finger down, toxic edition. Now, no cheating. We want to see a real authentic reaction. So pause this video, click duet, and let's get started. Put a finger down if you've ever texted someone, I'm on my way, when you haven't even left the house. Put a finger down if you have a mean resting face. Put a finger down if you've seriously considered ghosting everyone. Put a finger down if you've ever checked someone's location to see if they were lying. Put a finger down if you're a Gemini, Leo, Capricorn, or Cancer. Put a finger down if you've ever led someone on. Put a finger down if you've ever flirted with your friend's ex. Put a finger down if you've ever posted a picture with someone just to make another person jealous. Put a finger down if you've ever dated one of your friend's exes. Put a finger down if you've ever broken up with someone over text. Put a finger down if you've ever posted a petty quote on your story just for one person to see it. This is put a finger down things everyone has done edition. I want to see everyone's raw reaction to this so stop this video, click duet and let's get started. Put a finger down if you've ever said ow even though it didn't hurt. Put a finger down if you've ever looked yourself up on Google. Put a finger down if you've ever pulled a push door or pushed a pull door. Put a finger down if you've ever tried opening the fridge door just enough to see the light go on and off. Put a finger down if you've ever faked an accent. Put a finger down if you've ever peed in the shower. Put a finger down if you've ever laughed uncontrollably before telling the story. Put a finger down if you've ever fake laughed at something that was not funny. Put a finger down if you've ever put your music on shuffle but then skipped through all the songs to find the one you want. And lastly, put a finger down if you've ever shouted stay at an object so that it wouldn't fall. Put a finger down if you seek small victories through the day. Put a finger down if you're always looking out for solutions. Put a finger down if you're okay with being judged by other people. And finally, put a finger down if you are not afraid to look dumb. And if you have four or more fingers down, you are a confident, radiant human being. We love to see it. And if you want to feel more confident about who you are, hit the link. Put a finger down, psycho edition. If you put five more fingers down, you're a psychopath. Put a finger down if you like to eat ice cubes. Put a finger down if you laugh when little kids trip and fall. Put a finger down if you could tell people by their footsteps. Put a finger down if you're a Cancer, Virgo, Sagittarius, or Gemini. Put a finger down if you are a quiet kid. Put a finger down if you get annoyed when someone breathes too loudly. Put a finger down if you drink milk by itself. Put a finger down if you would throw a crying baby off a plane if it was being too loud. Put a finger down if you start crying when you get angry. Put a finger down if you have multiple personalities for different people. Put a finger down, embarrassing edition. Put a finger down if you've ever farted in public or school. Put a finger down if you've ever got rejected. Put a finger down if you've ever fell in public. Put a finger down if you ever got yelled at by a teacher in front of your entire class. Put a finger down if you've ever walked in on someone in the bathroom. Put a finger down if someone ever walked in on you in the bathroom. Put a finger down if you've ever told a joke and nobody laughed at it. Put a finger down if you've been caught cheating in a board game. Put a finger down if you've ever spilt water in your pants and it looked like you peed your pants. Put a finger down if you've ever been bullied. This is... Put a finger down, innocent edition. I want to see everyone's raw reaction to this, so pause this video, click duet, and let's get started. So, put a finger down if you're always the one to apologise first. Put a finger down if you can't stand arguments or disagreements. Put a finger down if other people's needs come before your own. 
Put a finger down if you forgive people too easily. Put a finger down if you always say sorry, even when it's not your fault. Put a finger down if you always try to see the good in people, which is also what gets you hurt. Put a finger down if you're at your happiest when other people are happy. Put a finger down if seeing other people smile instantly makes you smile. Put a finger down if your family and friends are the most important thing in the world to you. And lastly, put a finger down if you believe what other people say a little bit too much. Put a finger down, but I will bully you relentlessly if you put any single finger down. Put a finger down if you watched Big Mouth and liked it. Finger down if you pronounce three like three. Not because of like a language barrier. Like if English is your first language and you still pronounce three like three. Put a finger down if you think you were born on an ugly birthday, like July 17th or something like that. Put a finger down if you like country music. Put a finger down if you have or still listen to Juice World and enjoy the music. Put a finger down if you press your religion onto anybody else. Put a finger down if you're under 15 in the year 2020. Put a finger down if you were raised by water signs, one or two of them. And put a finger down if your favorite color is red or orange.